Hello, welcome back. As we press into, I think, the double digits of our generations of full glory. We got to what I assume is the final boss the last time round, or at least the form of the final boss. We did see at least two forms. And we've gone for the ultimate armor, the ultimate hat, and one of the best miscellaneous items this time. So let's go with... With... Warwick Pelty. Well, that's not a name that inspires confidence. Last time we were Hammer Jackman. And even Hammer Jackman couldn't defeat that boss. So what sort of chance does Warwick Pelty stand? Oh, fucking no! Seriously! I mean, these are the first enemies out of the gate, and they still hurt us and knock us down. It's getting beyond a joke here. Get away from me! And I would like to just run past these enemies and not waste my time with them. But as far as I can tell, that actually doesn't help. It seems like enemies just continue to chase you down for as long as they're alive. So we have to kill all of this shit. Ugh, come on, Warwick. And incidentally, that's not how you spell Warwick. Warwick is actually the name of a place. And um, a pretty nice castle, actually. In England. And it's spelt W A R W I C K. That's not Warwick, that's Warwick. And Warwick doesn't have two R's. Alright. So, let's just keep hacking through all this stuff. Ah, fuck! Fuck the gnolls! Get away from me, you fuckers! Get off! Seriously, I would be laughing about the ludicrousness of this non situation if it wasn't so irritating. Like it's, it's actually so stupid that it's becoming really aggravating. Fuck! Get off! I convinced one of them was going to hit me just then. But the mage hit me instead. I can't believe we've taken so much damage at this early stage. And mainly because of the bastard gnolls. Okay. Come on, Warwick. We can do this. Kill slimes, kill gnolls, kill mages. Dodge rocks. We haven't even got to the falling enemy part yet. It seems like we got there much more quickly last time. Fuck off! Shooting me out of the air. Okay, kill the null. Really, that slime should have been completely obliterated by that rock. But no! No. There's some kind of special human killing rocks that don't hurt anything that isn't human. Alright. Kill the gnolls. Kill the wizard guy. Brutes. Still going down in two hits, as last time, so that's nice. Well, I, I didn't expect that to change since we're using the same weapon, but it's just. I'm still enjoying that effect. The fact that I can now hack through these enemies so quickly. The ones that caused me to practically poo myself in terror the first time are now just cannon fodder. Or sword fodder. Get off! Oh! Damn it! No! Okay, hack through some more stuff. Okay. I can't believe we haven't run into falling enemies yet. I'm sure we're at that point. In fact, I'd say we're past that point. But we're still facing simple rocks rather than falling enemies. Oh, get off me! Wow, I can't believe I killed that knoll mid-pounce. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Alright, here are the falling enemies. Ah, oh, get off, stupid piece of crap. And that charm we bought for five grand that allegedly causes 
any of the um, elemental effects, fire, freezing, shock, and so on, has finally actually had an effect. It's that occasional thing again. It said occasionally has an effect, and it really means almost never has that effect. God, that was a disaster. That mass of enemies just stomping us. Get off! At least we get a health refill when we reach the boss. If we reach the boss, I'm not convinced Warwick Pelty is actually up to it. Okay, we need to take this guy down. I'm not too worried about brutes. Actually, despite the fact that brutes are intimidating, and if they grab you, they're serious fuckers. In many ways, they're actually less of a concern than base level gnolls are. Because as long as you don't let them grab you, they're not a big deal. God, we may not even make it to the boss here. Even though we have almost all the best gear in the game. Get off! I can't believe I didn't take a hit there. Same there. Right, Knowles. No, no. <sighs> the quizzical sounds all the enemies make are starting to grate, I have to say. Oh? Okay, put that guy out of his misery. Come on, brute, down you go. And the orc with the club, who really shouldn't be here. He's way out of his league at this point. Uh, out of his depth, that is. Out of his league would be, you know, he's trying to chat himself up, but he's too attractive for himself, which is just a weird mental image. Being out of your own league. Alright. Oh, thank God for that. We're back to the simple rock launching ballistas. That is a relief. Alright. Fuck. We've got maybe two hits left if we're lucky. Quite possibly just one. Come on, take out the brute. There we go, take out the knoll. Basic orc shouldn't be a big deal. Okay, bait these guys forward a bit. There we go, take out the ballista. And the brute should go down. There we go. We must be getting close back. This actually feels like a longer run to the boss than last time. Take out that guy. Are we there? I think we're there. Almost no health, but we do get a refill. Ready? Here we go. So, as before, I'm going to cheese it, because it takes so bloody long to get back here, I don't want to take any risks that I don't have to. Fuck! I can't believe he keeps hitting me after I hit him. That's really fucking irritating. Get back! Why does that sometimes work and sometimes not? Fuck! Oh, god damn it! Get off! God, this is really fucking irritatingly designed boss here. Did we get a refill between his first and second forms? I don't remember. I think we probably don't, but I'm not certain. God damn it, how do we have better gear and yet find it harder to fight him? Oh, shit balls! Oh, I'm really losing patience with this game, I have to say. One more, one more go. If I don't beat that bastard the next time, I quit. Because <sighs> I, I know it's not exactly an admirable quality to go, you know what, I've just had enough. I've got to the final boss, but I give up. But I've been recording this in one sitting because there's no save function. And I'm rapidly running out of stamina with slogging through all that crap. Alright. Well, do we have enough money to get the best weapon and an appropriate thing to allow us to use it without dying? Okay, we need 30,000 for that, which leaves us with 29,000 for something else. Was it? It wasn't armor, it was one of these things, right? Yeah. Yes. So, actually, we can buy both of the remaining best things and we'll just have all of the best gear. 
all the top stuff in every category. There. We can no longer buy any better things. Rejoin me next time when we go in there with all the best kit in the game and see if we can actually take down that boss. Wish me luck. Bye for now.